y'all god bless you today we have another monday makeup and devotional so i'll just be getting ready and sharing today's devotional with y'all i pray that y'all are blessed and without further ado let's go ahead and get started hey y'all today is october 17th and the title of today's devotional is release your cares to god and it begins by saying the other day a door metaphorically closed in my face it wasn't just a normal kind of door it was an opportunity that i had been praying for and hoping for it was something i knew from the bottom of my soul that god would make happen for me but he didn't i was wrong and i spent the next few days angry confused and questioning god's plans for my life after all I knew exactly what was in God's brain and how he wanted me to carry out his master plan for me to take over the world. And yes, of course, I'm being sarcastic. After a few days of wallowing in self-pity, I woke up with a message from God. It wasn't audible, and it wasn't through someone else's voice, as it sometimes is. It was something that I felt in my gut. And I wrote it down on a piece of paper so I wouldn't forget it. The message was simple. Release your cares to God. The moment I sat down and talked to him about my worries and my frustrations, I experienced a joy like I've never felt before. Honestly, it was incredible. I went from being angry and frustrated with God to having confidence that he was with me by my side through it all. For years, I heard about God and memorized verses in the Bible. I could recite the books of the Bible and tell you all of Sunday school answers and how God works in the world. But I never really knew him. I knew about God, but didn't really know Him. That is, until the moment God spoke to me. And I went from knowing about God to feeling Him move in my daily life. I don't say all of this to brag. I just want you to hear a clear and simple lesson from God Himself that I believe He spoke to me that morning. Release your cares to God. When you go to God in prayer and ask Him to carry your stressors, worries, failures, and questions, you will immediately understand what I'm talking about. You'll begin to realize that God can carry the weight of your frustration so you can continue becoming the person He made you to become. And a side note, if you're frustrated because your plan didn't work out, remember that sometimes God's plan is different from anything we could ever dream of. Be confident in the truth that He is with you, fighting for you, and wants to carry your load so you can be his missionary on earth. Today's Bible verse comes from Philippians 1, 6. And the Bible says, He who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus. So Father God, I come to you in the name of Jesus Christ. And I thank you, Father God, for today's devotional. I thank you for each person that has received from this devotional. And I thank you, Father God, for being the Heavenly Father that we can always come to. That when man fails us, Father God, we stand confident in knowing that you never will. I thank you, Father God, that your arms are always wide open for those that need, Father God, and you will always receive them when they are worried, when they are frustrated, when they are confused. And I thank you, Father God, that you fill us up with joy. I pray, Father God, for each and every person that is struggling right now, questioning what your plan is, Father God, that they would run to you and cast all of their cares to you because you care for them. I pray, Father God, for a complete infilling of joy and peace that completely surpasses all understanding. In the name of Jesus, amen. All right, y'all, that wraps up this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it, and I really pray that y'all were blessed by the devotional that I shared. If you have any prayer requests, do not hesitate to reach out to me. I would love to pray for you. Again, thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. God bless y'all today and always, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.